Hey guys, in this video I'm going to show you how you can password protect your folders on your computer um, or really any other file you have on your computer as well, whether it's documents, PDF files, Excel files, or anything. Um, but this is a software product that I just purchased. You can see up here it is registered. And it is one of the easiest tools that I have found that will allow me to password protect folders or, or other files. And you can download a free trial of it here at lockmyfolder.com. And the link is also underneath this video in the description box. If you click on it, it'll take you straight to this page where you can click a screen button and download the free version, which does work. It just has a few limitations to it. And if you want um, access to all the rights, um, you obviously have to buy the full version, which is $39.95. Let me show you how it works. I have a folder on my desktop here. It's called Super Secret Stuff. And if I double click on it, you'll see it has three items in it. It has an image of my super secret uh, shampooer. It has an Excel file, which is loaded with secrets. It has a password, which is a bunch of numbers. And it has my top secret word document. As you can see, this document contains all my super secret files. Okay, and let's say we want to password protect this folder. Well, we can do that several ways. Number one, we can go up here to encrypt file if we want to encrypt just the files. Or if we want to do the whole folder, we're going to encrypt folder and the desktop. And you can see here is the super secret stuff folder. I'm going to click it, click OK. It's going to ask me what password I want to use to password protect this folder. And I'm just going to enter something really simple. Then it's going to ask me what strength I want to encrypt it with. I can do normal, which is uh, it encrypts it really fast. Um, then there's high, which uh, says here it scrambles and encrypts file headers. And then there's a highest, which is 256-bit, which apparently is like military grade. So chances of somebody accessing it are very slim. And I got the option here where I can also hide the folder. So if I choose hidden and encrypt it, it's going to remove the folder from my desktop, and you're not even going to see it. The only place you're going to be able to view it is within this software here. I'm just going to leave it on my desktop for now and click local and encrypt. You can see here it encrypted the folder, and let's go back to my desktop, and it moved it. Let me bring it back up here, and you can see now it has a lock on it where it's showing that it's been password protected. So if I double click on it, it's going to ask me what do I want, you know, or my password. I'm going to enter my password, and I can choose browse to quickly browse it, then it'll lock it back. I can choose temporary. Um, which means it'll unlock it, then it'll ask me if I want to lock it back. Or I can choose complete, which means if I uh, click that and decrypt, it's basically just going to unlock it. And after that, it's, it's going to give me full access to it again. And then if I want to password protect it, I have to do it again. Now, a great thing about this tool is I can also right-click this folder, and I can encrypt it this way too. And then I just simply just enter the password. I want to use encrypt, and it keeps moving it and it's password protected again. And so really that's how easy the software is to use. Let me refresh this. And it's still up here and then if I double click it it's going to ask me for a password before I can access it. And one great thing is too I can also password protect this software. So if I don't want people accessing the software to see what files I have encrypted I can also password protect that by going up to my settings and my security and running the application with a password and I can set a password for that too. And so really that's all there is to the software. Um, it also comes with a file shredder. You can right click and shred any kind of a file or folder. Um, it also apparently will shred it to like military grade so it's completely wiped from your hard drive. You can protect an entire drive from being accessed also. Um, and then there's just a few additional settings within here. It allows you to check for updates. You can choose different skins or change the icon of when your folder is locked or file is locked. And so that's all there is to it. Like I said, if you want to check it out and download the free trial just to see how well it works for you, go to lockmyfolder.com, and I wish you guys the best with it.